Alrighty, guys. Today is the day. Today is the day we get revenge. Man, we get a lot of revenge in this series. But hey, if we stop dying, we wouldn't need to get all this revenge. But welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to our Mega Modded Survival Series. <gasps> Who are we getting revenge on, though, today, Miola? Who are we getting revenge on? Well... Obviously, Spinebreaker, of course. I mean, who else is there to get revenge on right this second? Who, who better of it? I mean, come on. It's in the title. It's probably in the thumbnail as well. Do I really need to spell it out any further? Today, we're going to take down Spinebreaker. Well, I mean, the, the, the strongest of the, the, the Pugnacia bosses at this point anyways. There are other bosses. Don't worry. We'll get to them another time. But Pugnacia is... Not Pugnacia. Spinebreaker. Oh, that devilish little Spino. He's the guy that recently took my Mr. Fist from me. He's the guy who we, well, we, we were basically one shot killed with. Yeah, he, he, he absolutely demolished us. And I want revenge. The only problem is, I don't even know if we've got a dinosaur that's possible of, of getting it done. That's that's the sad part. Uh, we, we really, oh, I don't actually know who our strongest dinosaur is at the moment i mean we've got a lot to choose from also i'm obviously negating neglecting i'm myth dinosaurs are out of the equation no spider emperors no no big old uh mammoth boys azula azula might be able to get it done but in saying that spinebreaker has an attack that will one shot us also you can't fly away from him so we need something that can basically hit 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 run hit 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 run it's it's gonna it's gonna be really really difficult elemental titan I think he's going to get caught up. I don't think it's going to go well for him. I don't even think he's fit for this one here. So I'm I'm a little bit stumped here. I'm a little bit stumped. I've sort of considered taming up something new for this. I know it sounds a little crazy, but we might need to. Uh, other than that, though, it's... Well, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I, I'm really, really confused. We could even try our brand spanking new Sunset Wyvern. Could possibly take Spinebreaker down the last of the Pugnacia bosses that we need to drop. I, I I don't know. But I mean, this guy might might be the answer to our problem. Other than that, though, the only other guy that I can consider taming up right this second who might be of help. Also, all these guys, of course, they're out of the equation. These are our Forbiddens, uh, or at least part of them. I'm thinking maybe we even go looking for a Promius. Maybe like a Promius, not a Poison Manticore, but damn, these guys are tough. We got absolutely obliterated by one of these guys the other day. No, I was looking at the Poison Gorilla. But then again, why would you get a poison gorilla to take down a boss that you can't actually knock out with poison? Maybe we need a fire fella. Maybe we need an electric dragon. Or maybe, maybe we just stick to what we know. Maybe we just try out this paradise fella up ahead. I actually can't remember how much damage this guy be dealing. Uh, but I guess we should take him out and take it, like, go for a little bit of a test drive real quickly. Bruntus, show me what you're made of. Okay, 72,000. And I, I... I can't actually remember. Yeah, that's not going to be enough. <laughs> We're dealing with someone with 100 million health here, guys. Oh, yeah. Something ridiculously powerful. We're going to need something that's impacting or like dropping, you know. Um, nope, nope. You're not going to land it. Get back up there. That's your little fucking... Nope. Oh, gosh. Uh, whatever. Just chilling here for a little bit, okay? We need something that's going to be dealing, you know, around that 1 million damage mark. And I don't really have many of those dinosaurs left anymore. I mean, we've got plenty that are over a billion, but nothing in the million range. I'm actually tempted to try out... I'm actually... How much damage were you dealing? See, the thing is, my man down here would actually be really, really handy. Because my man here can do his little, like, dive bomb attack, dealing somewhere in the range of half a million to a million uh, damage. The only problem is, um, yeah, Spinebreaker has his little grounding attack, which means you can't fly away. But how strong is me Bronto boy? Other than being ridiculously fast. Yeah, he'd be dealing like a half a million or a quarter of a million, whatever that is, a million. But he does have 20 levels up his sleeve. So if I were to, I think I was actually meant to drop a dino mind wipe tonic on this guy at some point, right? I, th I think I mentioned that, but I guess we should probably do that because this guy's got way too many levels in movement speed. Uh, where did I just put those levels? Just I, I just did the same mistake, didn't I, guys? I just put, I just put 20 levels into movement speed, didn't I? Oh, no. I think I did. I think I did. Yeah, this guy's moving even far. Oh, oh, no. Okay, careful. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. No, no, no. Slow down. Slow it down. Okay. No, no. So, let's not get too carried away with ourselves. All right. Oh, no. Maybe I did put... I don't even know where I put them. I'm losing the plot. Anyways, I think what we're going to do... I think we're going to... Ooh, ancient. Hold on. Hold on. Let me just... Can I drop this guy? Oh, no. If I can't even take down an ancient turkey, what hope do I have? I'm not even stomping him successfully. Oh, boy. Uh, hello, ancient turkey. Yeah, see, this guy ain't, this guy ain't cut for it. He ain't going to get the job done. You know what I reckon we got to do? Oh, gosh. You guys nearly died to full damage. All right. 
One step at a time. One step at a time. Just take it easy. Can I just bend my way around this gate? Oh, you bet we can. Yeah, that's the type of security we got at this base. I'm actually thinking what we're going to have to do is get a gorilla. Those gorillas, we, we know from experience, those guys pack an absolute ridiculous sized punch. I need a gorilla in my life. We need a Megapithecus. And that's all there is to it. So, okay, no, if I can actually land in there. I don't know why I built the staircases leading down into this thing. If like, just about every time, okay, just, can I, can I, I can't even get in there. I can't even get in there. If, if every time we enter our little dungeon here, I kind of come through the little frog mouth opening. Anyways, gorillas. We have the poison fella. We also have uh, Mega Pith. We've got, uh, no, no, wait, Mega Pith. Yeah, we've got the primeval version, of course. Ridiculously high level. That's actually kind of interesting, but no. I think we're going for a poison gorilla. I think it's about time we do this. He's only level 400, but I think this guy is going to be hes going to be the, the, the hit that we need. I, I think so, at least. Anyway, so 2578. Uh, the only thing is, I need to remember what we actually need to feed one of these guys to tame them up. Because I can't for the life of me actually remember. I know that there was something... Oh, oh, we need a brain. What did I recently use one of those brains for? Huh. Did I, did I use a brain recently for something? Did I, what did I tame up using one of these? Or did we consider it? We've got the manticore. Did I use them for something else? Or am I just having a complete mental blank right now? I never used it on a manticore. I never used it on a, on a dragon. I never used it on a, I think, I think we're just going to craft one up. Well, look at that. We're crafting one up. I swear I crafted one not too long ago. Or maybe I just considered. Anyways, 2578. Let's go and do this thing. I need somebody to take me out there. My man, you are the perfect contender for this today. Come with me, my friend. We are going to do something very dumb. Well, hopefully not very dumb. Hopefully this pays off because this is like some... Oh, this, this might not pay off is what, I, is what I'm saying. <laughs> 2578 though. So he should be over in this direct... Wait, he's, he's in the desert. He's in the desert. That's good. That's good, because it's kind of on the way to Spinebreaker. Even though I've, I've, he's obviously not going to be ready straight off the bat to fight Spinebreaker. It, it doesn't matter. Let's just get us a poison gorilla, and then we'll cross the, like, cross the bridge after that. There he is. There's that green old jiggly fella. I've never tamed one of these gorillas. I've died to them many, many times. Also, I completely forgot to bring a poison dinosaur with me. But then again, I think I'd rather try and knock this guy out from the ground. Because uh, knowing what the electric versions of these guys was like... I don't really want to be on the grounds next to one of these guys. If the electric guys were knocking all my dinosaurs out and killing them. Yeah, I'm happy to stay up here, to be honest. Very, very, very happy to stay up here. All right, just sit still. No, no, no. Where are you going? Yes. Do that. Do that. Do that. Keep doing that. Did I really just miss? There we go. That's the shot I'm looking for. All right. No. Okay. I will not forgive myself if I die. Oh, okay. No, that's good. Didn't do torpor. It didn't do torpor. That's fine. Okay. If I get my man killed doing this, I will absolutely... I'll cry. I'll cry. I refuse to... Ouch. I refuse to get Mr. Uh, my man killed. Where are you going, buddy? Where are you going? Are you running from me? You be running from me? Come on, dude. Oh. Nightmare Pegasus. It's all good. I think it's a Nightmare Pegasus doing it. I have no idea what's dropping those meteors, but I don't see an elemental titan nearby. Anyways, gorilla dude. Oh, I just shot a Titan. Oh, no. All right, Titan, I'm sorry. Sorry. Uh, okay, Gorilla, can you just can you just get out of here? <laughs> Wait, why didn't I try bowler you? I don't think a bowler would work, but it would have been a handy old attempt anyways. All right, one second. Titan needs to be dealt with, even though it would be perfect to use as Gorilla XP. Oh, come on. Oh, just hit it once. That's all you got to do. All right, where'd Gorilla Boy go? to go over in this direction mr gorilla yeah it is a nightmare pegasus dropping those there he is hey buddy all right i only gotta hit you with like two arrows so if you could just stop moving yes just like that no 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 okay oh gosh oh gosh i can't even see what i'm doing right now gorilla stop moving oh no oh gosh i'm way too close i'm way too close it's all good we got him yeah all right nice well, that was a little bit touch and go for a second there, but we got him. That's the main thing. Let's go ahead. Did I grab my brain? I did. There you go, buddy. Probius Poison Gorilla has been tamed. I'll see. There we go. Nice. Oh, hey, little Ferox. How you doing, buddy? I still... Wait a second. <gasps> Can I tame one of you? 
You want some elements? Wait, can I not... Can you not peaceful feed these guys? Is that not how they work right now? I'm assuming maybe because it's a Pugnacia one that they, they tame up a different way. Wait, use elements near Ferox to tame. I, what do you mean use elements? What do you mean that? I've, I've, I'm trying to feed it to you. What do you mean by use it? Like, like use it? How do you, how do you use elements? Use. Oh, like that. Oh, snap. Did I just, oh no. Oh no, no, no. Hey, big guy. Uh, are we cool? Oh, so you look, okay, you made a mistake. I don't know why you did that. That was probably, that was probably, in hindsight, it's probably a dumb idea, buddy. I would recommend that. <laughs> All righty, let's see how strong this guy can get. My man, you've done well today, my friend. Hop up in here real quickly. I'm taking my guy here for a test drive. I guess I forgot how to tame a Ferox suddenly. It's really inconvenient, but what are you going to do? Gorilla boy! Let's find out what you're made of, buddy. Let's see if you are the answer to my problems. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. 258,000 damage as a base hit? Okay, that is, ridic that, that, is, that is ridiculous. That is some next level damage right there. How about if he throws a rock? I'll say the, the, the rock throwing animation on gorillas right now is so yeah and that one there I don't know why that happens but it's, it's so it's so da janky um I don't think my dude here would be dealing torpor though actually no it's because he's one-shotting everything he, he attacks that's why we don't know if he's dealing torpor or not um all right I think what we're gonna have to do is take him home get some get some experience potions into him just to see what sort of uh well what he's capable of and then we're going to throw him at Spinebreaker. And we'll see what happens from there, I suppose. All right, guys. Leave it. Leave me alone. So, we're looking at 8 million health. Wow. He doesn't gain a whole lot. Actually, he doesn't gain much at all every level of health I'm putting into him. He's kind of just got his 8 million, and I guess I guess he's happy with that. 8 million is a good start, though. So, maybe we'll just maybe I'll just stop doing that. Uh, melee damage through the roof. Bit, bit of speed. Just a little bit of speed. 150% would be nice. And then melee damage. And this guy's never going to be able to... Yes. All right. This is exactly what I need. This is exactly like the million damage dealer that I'm looking for. Titan. Come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. This is ridiculous. <gasps> Hold on. Just don't get hit by this dire wolf. These dire wolves are way too strong. Ugh. I'm going to say way too strong. I would just mean that they're tough. They're tough opponents. That's all. Thank you very much, Titan. Oh, I should have checked the Torpor. I forgot. Oh, well. Bronte. Get wrecked, son. Get wrecked. This guy here might be able to survive an attack. Hello, Paradis Bronte. Oh, we can't. All right, let's find out if we actually do a Torpor. We do. Oh, that's cool. We just get to find dinosaurs with a lot of health and not a lot of Torpor. And then, and then we'll be able to knock out anything. Oh, gosh. Where am I right now, though? Trying to find my way home. Oh, wait. We should be over in this direction, right? If we want to get back home. Up here through the desert. The desert of dreams. Well, really the desert of nightmares. We've had a lot of bad experiences out here in the desert. I try to avoid this place for a reason. Anyways, we got 35 more levels up our sleeve. I'm going to get a little bit more speed. We got 200% and then the rest are all going into melee damage. As simple as that. This guy is definitely... The hitter like a truck that I'm looking for. We just got to get him nice and maybe even maxed out. We'll see. Wait. I don't. I couldn't remember if he was going to take full damage from that or not. So decided to bail out of that one. All right. Gorilla boy. Let's see what you're made of. Actually, just hit this Lymantria, will you? Yes. Yes, indeed. That is the damage that I'm looking for. Now we just got to. Oh, wait. Gorilla, stay there. Stay there. Stop. I don't even know where he Yeah, he's right there. It's all good. Uh, to get the experience potions that we need. I think I need Stimberries. I think we, we, we learned that. Yes. Okay. So, um, oh, damn. I just realized my Elemental Titan doesn't actually collect berries, do you? So, I guess we're going to have to go for a quick little spin on Skittles the Stego. Except this time, we're going to be turning his Mohawk white. There we go. Oh, actually, we got some. Actually, no. That's right. We learned that there's like a ton of bushes just out here. Yeah. I forgot about this little patch out here by the desert. Look at this. You ready? Actually. Couple little last, oh, one last level into melee damage. Boom. Uh, 600 steam berries. Not bad. Pretty good. Pretty good. That's going to be plenty of experience potions for us. Well, for our gorilla. 
I don't really get to use them myself. But uh, that's it. We're good now. Let me just grab those stim berries. Last time I uh, went to grab these stim berries, I couldn't find them. And they were just like staring me straight in the face. <laughs> but uh, it's all good. It's all good. We've got them now. That's all that matters. Let's go and craft these suckers up. Get them in. Elixir. I'm looking for the experience elixirs. The only thing... Oh, no, no. We should have all of these resources, right? How many can I craft? 13! Wait, am I, what am I missing? Just for one. What am I missing for one more? Stimberries. Oh, wow. Oh, these things need 100 stimberries each. All right, that explains it. I guess I never paid attention to actually <laughs> how many you needed for the recipe. Anyways, though, let's get this guy cranked up. Uh, we might have just maxed him out already. Maybe not. Let me just have a little peek here. Three, three. Oh, no, he's still going. That's 400. Oh, no, he can get a few more levels. Yeah, he's got a few more in him. 213. Oh, yeah, it's looking pretty good if you ask me. All right, let's go. Crank it right up. Oh, gosh. This guy's gonna... Dude, this guy could even one-shot Spine Breaker, possibly, maybe. I don't know. And now I feel like I'm gonna give him a little bit more health. Uh, definitely a little bit more stamina. That stamina's not doing nothing, though. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Things are about to get crazy. I don't actually know how many levels this guy's got, though. All right, so he's got 100 left to drop on him. Um, he's got 20 into health. He's got four into stamina. Uh, 20, 35, 39, 192. So I think he's got eight more levels to gain other than the 100 that I've still got to allocate on him. So he's still got eight levels in there somewhere. There's your final eight levels. That's it. He's maxed out. He's maxed out to the brim. Are we just really, are we really putting all these levels into melee damage? Is this, this is going to be such a mistake. I don't know why I'm doing this. I don't know why. All right, let's put a little bit of speed in there as well. Just just for fun. All right. And we'll leave like 12 levels just in case I decide to like do something different, I suppose. All righty. So, yeah, let's just finish him off. Why not? All right, there we go. Fantastic. Nice. Okay. Oh, this is dumb. This is so dumb. Why are we doing dumb things like this? Uh, let me go and clear out this inventory just so I know what I'm looking at. We got some health potions in there just in case. It's time to go pay Spinebreaker a visit. And I didn't check his coordinates, so hopefully he is exactly where I left him. Uh, also, we got to be careful about fall, la fall, la fall, la la la. fall damage. Gosh, can't say words today. It's a little bit, it's a little bit ridiculous. Also, I don't think he takes fall damage, so we don't even have to worry about that. Oh, hey, dragon fellow up there. We'll say, I hear a demon saber down here on the ground with us. So I'm just gonna, just gonna run straight through. Oh, you know what? No, I don't want to attack anything. I, I, I was, I was, oh, I nearly did it, but I don't actually want to punch anything. I want to see what sort of damage we're dealing. Um, I want it to be a surprise. I kind of just want to hit something and see what happens. Also, can you not swim well? Uh, he can run on the bottom of the water, but he can't really float. All right, good to know. Considering this boss battle going to be like literally on the edge of a swamp. Alrighty. Come on. Come on. Nearly there. All right. All right. I want to save this first hit for Spinebreaker himself. Just to see what sort of damage we're dealing. The grand unveiling of our brand spanking new poison gorilla is ahead of us. Spinebreaker, my dude. It's time. Maybe I'll just watch this Karkonos. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no! Don't spoil it! Oh, I keep going to use the attack. Stop. It's stop. Stop. It's so tempting. I don't like that these stupid Dimorphodons are attacking me. I can't resist it. Let's go. Let's do this thing. How much health has he got? He has. He has reminded me of my dead body right beside us. But here he is. Mr. 103 million health or whatever he is. In three. In two. In one. Pff, that's a lot of damage. And I didn't even hit our target. <laughs> All right. Let's go, big guy. Let's go. So we're going to pay attention to that. To that. Okay, I'm gonna get out. I'm gonna go, 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 go! Run! No! What are you doing? Oh my gosh! You were meant to run. He was meant to run. He was meant to run. Why didn't he run away? <gasps> are you serious? Are you serious? I think I might have given him too many speed levels for his own good. And then he got stuck on like a rock or something and couldn't keep running. Oh, no. I think I think I over leveled him and it ended up working against. Oh, you guys to be kidding me. All right, fine. Azula. Azula, I need a hand, buddy. I need your help. 
I I didn't even know. I don't even know if you're gonna survive very well against this, because I think I think our poison I think our poison gorilla was even stronger than you. Like by a long shot, to be honest. I don't think I don't think this guy be hitting. Oh, there he is. Oh, you're just gonna leave his body sitting there. You're just gonna leave both our bodies sitting. Look at this. Completely healed up as if nothing ever happened. That attack is so bloody strong. All right. Well, I don't think he gets aggressive until we attack him. So I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. I hope you don't get aggressive. I'm just gonna grab my stuff. Thank you for allowing me to do that. Gorilla, you're dead, aren't you, buddy? You are. Oh my gosh. That sucks. I just want to get some revenge. Oh, is that too much to ask? Even with health potions, I can't even get the job done. Um, do I have any ranged attacks? No, Azula doesn't have any ranged attacks. If, uh, let me just, let me just attack once and run away, okay? All right, 1.3 million. All right. I just want you to, yeah, okay, yes. That's the attack I need to dodge. That's the one. This giant blue orb is trouble. Also, it looks like I might be able to fly. He hasn't hit me with his little flying debuff. So that's kind of nice. All right. So as long as we avoid black orb of death, we might be okay here. Spinebreaker is literally the king of the one hit. He will kill anything that that black orb kills. That's why we call it the black orb of death. It literally, it is just the black orb of death. That's all there is to it. That's, that's all there is. I just got to make sure I don't get stuck in it. There it is again. There it is again. Back it up, back it up, back it up. This thing is stronger than the tornado. All right, we are like <laughs> backing up ever so slowly, but I think we're okay. Oh, why couldn't I do that with my gorilla? My gorilla would have killed this guy in 20 hits. Yeah, that's right. 100 divided by 5 million is 20. No, but anyway, uh, math. Math's not my strong suit right this second. Focusing too much on getting this guy killed. Ugh. We all know what happens when you don't get these guys killed successfully. They end up like our Tempest did, where you end up using the hell. Okay, he's backed me against the side of a cliff. Okay, no, no, no. Run, no, run. Okay, okay. Can't go too far though. We're gonna keep the pressure on, otherwise he heals up. Oh, I'm so torn, I don't know what to do. Okay, good, good, good. It's gone, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. Oh, that was close. Oh, that was way too close. But here we go. The final blows. Finish him. Finish him. I don't even know how much health this got. All I'm looking at is that health bar. And we have done it. At last. At last. At last. We've finally done it. I don't even have any armor on. Damn. Well, that just happened, baby. That just happened. That's right. You witnessed greatness just then. And I got a helmet. We actually got a different Vulcan piece that time. Nice. Um, 2000 armor. That's pretty good. Never get lost again with the tech helmet's night vision. Also provides... Oh, and you use O to activate. Oh, cool. So I can put this on. Right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Because you guys know I don't like my tech helmet because it gets a little bit like... I don't know. Takes up too much room on your screen. I think... Yeah, we don't have the HUDs. And pressing E doesn't activate it. You have to press O. Oh, look at that. The HUD still disappears. Oh, that's cool. Oh, nice. All right, we finally got a tech helmet we're actually gonna use. <laughs> um, and I'm gonna hide it. I'm gonna hide it. And I should probably put some, I actually don't know if, uh, I don't even know if you can power these things up. Where's my element though? It says you can, but I don't know what powering it up would actually do. Um, no, I'm trying to I'm trying to hide my hat. Hide your hat. There, that bearded hat. Unfortunately, it doesn't make me look any cooler because we're hiding it. Uh, but hey, it's another one of the tech pieces that we didn't, previously have so now we have two out of five i guess we got to go looking for the the leggings we got to go looking for the chest uh, the gauntlets and then we got to go looking for the boots but hey two out of five is a good start i just can't believe i can't believe we've actually done it i can't believe we lost the gorilla i feel like i, I really didn't want to use our manticore i actually didn't think our manticore was gonna go very well against it to be honest that actually ended up going a lot better than i thought it was going to but I think the gorilla had a better chance. I just, I got stuck. I fell into the trap for a second time. I fell into the same trap twice. Pretty, pretty, pretty embarrassing if you ask me. But in good news, we now have Spinebreaker's spine. So that is going to allow us to do one of two things. We can either use it to sacrifice to craft up the mummy module, which allows us to get our very own permanent Mega Mac. Or, which, but yeah, then we need that stuff still. 
or it lets us well it lets us get our own spine breaker which if you ask me i think i'm gonna pick 100 percent of the times the only thing is we need a brood mother and we need an indominus rex well i just so happen to have plenty of time to do that so let's do it let's do it let's do exactly that uh we got a couple extra okay i'm just gonna bring these all into my own spot here i thought we had some double ups but hmm did i use all of them or something either way i'm gonna need myself um what's the team of stuff called again i always forget nutrients we're gonna need some new wait how do i not have primal meat wait what i literally have primal hide but i do not have primal meat how dare you? you 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 mean to tell me i don't have any primal meat well let me go and fix that lord zuko my friend oh or the other option is we just use Lord Zuko as a sacrifice today. But that makes me feel kind of sad if we were to do that. Man, what is with the amount of Astrocetuses out here? These guys aren't meant to spawn very frequently. Also, hello, Dodo Wyvern. I see you sitting down there. That's definitely a Dodo Wyvern, right? Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, it is. Uh, he hasn't loaded in, though, for some reason. Yeah, my world's been getting super duper laggy lately. I have no idea what's causing it, but we are lagging through the roof as of late. I've been uh, I've been trying to fix it, but yeah, I, I don't know what's causing it. The world's just, I, it might just be that there's too many dinosaurs, too many structures. The world is just slowing down quite a bit. I'm not too sure, but it's definitely not running properly. This dragon looks, oh, it's primeval. Ooh, all right, I'm going to go kill that in a second. Actually, I'm going to go kill that right now. What am I talking about? You're not like, you're like barely loaded in as well. What is up with my well? Just not loading things in right now. It's so weird. All right, all right. We got our little piece of primal meat, except only one of them. Yeah, I only need one. Duh. I think I've actually like just, I think I'm just missing a few brain cells today, to be honest. I've just like completely forgotten like everything. Like I need this satiating nutriment for one thing and one thing only for taming a primeval yes i know we got a team of primeval but we were only talking about killing the primevals a second ago so i've literally just forgotten everything i i don't even know what's going through my head right this second but nutriment give me one of those we only need one why was i talking about needing two of them anyways anyways now we can go ahead and drop all of these back across uh we've got our thing here for taming one of them and then we're going to need we need to know what we need, I suppose. What do we actually need to kill? Broodmother and an Indominus Rex. And then we just got to tame whatever we can find. Let me get those coordinates. All right. So one of our friends, I think it's the Indominus Rex. I imagine it's the Indominus Rex. It should be at 55-55, but I've completely missed. I always, I always struggle when it comes to navigating through this wet redwood. I don't know what it is. We literally had this issue just the other day uh, in Domo. Where are you though, buddy? You got to be here some... There he is. There you are. Come on. Thank you very much. Wait. Yes. <gasps> What's breathing fire on me? Wyvern? Why is there a wyvern out here? This isn't a wyvern. It's just an ordinary fire wyvern too. Okay, that's kind of weird. They don't normally live out there. That's that's quite bizarre as a matter of fact. Next up though, we're heading to the desert where there are two broodmothers. One of which I will kill. The other of which I will tame. And I imagine, I'm not even looking at the coordinates. I imagine they're going to be in this little watery area because I've spotted them down here before. Am I right or am I I'm wrong? Hmm. Okay. Where are they then? I'm looking at, oh, 21. I'm meant to be, I think we're going to go south. Where are they going to be up here then? Yeah, okay. There's one of them. Wasn't expecting that, but sure. I guess this is the guy we're going to tame up because why not? All right, here we go. Last few shots. Hey, wait. Why is it? Oh, it catches me out every time he does that. He does his death animation when you knock him out and it looks like you've killed him, but no, you haven't really. Anyways, there you go, buddy. Get tamed up. Fantastic. He's back alive. Also, who just decided to attack me? I don't actually know. This guy at least can get a uh, Pokeball though, so that's kind of nice. And the last piece of the puzzle that we need is, of course, the other Broodmother, which is... I think it's down here somewhere. Should be down here somewhere. I can hear it, but I can't see it. Is there like a cave down here or something? Oh, there he is. You were hiding from me, you banana. What is wrong with you? Thank you. All right. Well, we've got everything that we need now. Let's get this show underway. 
This is what we've all been waiting for. Spinebreaker is about to be in our control. Where is he? There it is. Bring it all across. All the energies, the sacrifice, everything ready to go in three, two, one, go! Nice. And of course, last but not least, our sacrifice. This big old beast right here. I'm sorry. Uh, I kind of don't feel bad about it because you got a little bit of an ugly face. My bad. Uh, get that in there. Eat that one there up. And here we go. <laughs> yeah. Finally, at last, Spinebreaker, the end of all hope is all mine. And I hate to do it, but uh, we're going to be checking him out tomorrow. That's right. Sorry, guys. It's been a long episode already. Tomorrow, though, we take our Spinebreaker out. We're going to get leveled up. We're going to see how powerful we can get. And then we're going to go and take over the world, basically. Yeah, that's right. We're going to destroy all hope, just like his name suggests. But if you did enjoy this video, then please go ahead, punch that thumbs up, make it rain those thumbs ups. But most importantly, have a fantastic day, and I'll catch you next time. Bye. For now.